Hello and welcome back to another speed build. I hope you had a great week. Today we're starting a project. This is actually going to be a speed build series where we are going to be building the high school musical high school. So I want to set a disclaimer before um, I start talking about the build. Um, this is not going to be an exact replica and I'm not going to be making all of the rooms. I would argue that the exterior is probably going to be the most accurate. Um, I really did my best, so I hope you like it. But the interior, I'm going to have a gym and I'm going to try and recreate the cafeteria, which you can see me doing here. Um, I'm not like decorating it. I'm just trying to figure out the floor plan and figure out how the, um, how the cafeteria will work. Because if you remember in the movie, there's actually like an upstairs to the cafeteria. So I do want to do that. But everything else is going to kind of be more just functional for The Sims. Because I feel like I was kind of, I'm kind of teetering that line of what's best for replica and what's best for gameplay and I kind of do want to be able to use this build and have it not be too big and too much so you'll notice um, that there are some rooms that I've blacked out and that's because I'm not using those areas of the build um, so yeah I'm mainly just doing I'm doing the basics I'm doing what we need in the sims um, I would say the exterior is more what's accurate to the High School Musical build. Um, I just don't think I'm, <laughs> like, talented enough in The Sims to build a completely accurate build for the High School Musical High School. So, this is what we're doing. Also, that is a tongue twister, by the way. High School Musical High School. Say that three times fast. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, I am putting in filler furniture just so I can deal with the windows and stuff because that's super helpful. Um, also, I'm placing down some items because um, you actually can't save the game if you don't have the requirements for a high school. So I'm just placing those down really quickly so I can save. <laughs> um, but yeah, so this, this build is, if you haven't noticed, it's three stories. The third story is completely blocked out. Um, you can't even access it. There's no stairs to it. Um, the second floor is really only like half usable. I have a chess slash library room that I'm going to put up here. And I also have a computer lab just because those are like the clubs in the school. So I feel like that would be good for, um, just to have in the build. Um, the rest of it is blocked out besides the cafeteria, but you can only access it from the, the downstairs. I considered adding like a gym and some other stuff. I also considered adding um, the auditorium. However, I didn't really know how I was going to do that. And I decided I didn't want this build to be too, too big. So I did, I did decide against it. Um, but we'll see. I haven't actually decorated it yet. I might change my mind. So I guess you'll find out. Um, but here I am finally starting to actually work on the exterior. Um, in the photo that I was using, there's like these cinder blocks or like these concrete blocks that have an E on them. I, Cause I think the school is called East High. Um, but I, I didn't really know what to use. So I used these planter boxes from high school years because it kind of gave the same vibe except added plants um, and then they also had some street lights so I added those and I'm adding some pathways um, I will say the exterior is not it's pretty simple I guess is what I'm trying to say the exterior is very simple um, and it is in the photos too so I didn't want to add so much stuff because this isn't like a, my coming from my own mind or my own vision this is a recreation and I want it to look like the original school at least from the front so I did my best with that um, I will say I also do add a little bump out to the back just to make it a little more interesting I do block it out 
but I did add that just so it's not so ugly in the back. Um, but I think we're gonna start, after I do the roof, we're probably gonna start doing, like, the doors and windows and stuff, I think. Um, <laughs> so I added a sign, and here I am, because in the photo, there's, like, this red banner, and this is the closest thing I could find. So we use that as, like, the red banner that's across the, the building there. Um, and I think it works well enough. And for the doors, I, I didn't know how to do this at first. Um, there's actually like a cutout where the doors are, so I figured it out. Um, so there's a little indent, almost like an archway into where the doors are, so I figured that out. Um, I, I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to, but I realized it's kind of an important part of the like architecture of the building, so I figured that out. And here I am just adding a ceiling paint, so... I did do that this time. I don't always add ceiling paint, but I feel like for a high school it made sense. Also, I felt like you could see this the white ceiling on that half wall, underneath that half wall. So, I wanted to add ceiling paint so it didn't look so odd. And now we're going in and adding windows, and I added a ton. I actually used uh, windows from Horse Ranch, which I think is kind of funny. Um, but they kind of matched the they kind of matched the what's the word i'm looking for um like the shape surprisingly they're a little big but they matched they kind of worked and i like how it looks so we add those around the entire building um and yeah um i am gonna be doing I don't know if this is going to be a two or three part build series. Um, obviously this is the first part and there will be a second part. I just don't know how long it's going to take me to decorate the interior. It depends if I change things. So um, we'll see how that goes. But um, it'll definitely be at least a two parter because I don't decorate at all in this build. In this uh, portion of the speed build so here I am fixing and adding the little bump out in the back just so it's not so ugly <laughs> um, and yeah um, also I would like to throw this out there um, if anyone has any suggestions for builds that you want to see please let me know in the comments I've been f in a very like creative rut with building lately but I feel like this channel has kind of become speed builds so I don't know what I should do or what you want to see also if there's anything else you want to see like would you be interested in pack reviews or um I don't know like a let's play I've never filmed a let's play before so I've never done like a legacy challenge and filmed it and edited it, but I could figure it out. So let me know if that's something you're interested in. And if so, what you would want to see, like if there's a specific challenge you would want to see. Um, or like I said, if you have build ideas or something you want to see recreated, let me know. Um, but yeah, I am excited to do this, to furnish this build. I think it'll be a lot of fun. Um... But yeah, the windows honestly are just taking forever. <laughs> the windows are taking a minute here. But I think we're about done with the windows. So I fiddled with the padding um, a little bit. And I think I end up just leaving it how it was. Or maybe I add a little bit to it. Because the bill just looked so, I don't know, boring. So I tried to add a little bit. Um, here I'm adding seating areas to the outside because there is actually a seating area um, in the photo I was looking at. So I decided to add that. And then um, I added a few trees, but I didn't really do a whole lot in terms of landscaping and pathing and all that. So I'm adding some trees here. And I remembered right now that I wanted to add cheer mats because I thought that would be good for the gym. So I added those really quickly before I forgot. Um, 
And then this was kind of a creative liberty. I added some trees to the walkway. It's not exactly in the photo. Um, so the landscaping was more just like what I thought would look good. Um, but here I am adding some more pathing. I guess I did add a little bit more. Um, and then I'm just looking for a giant sign or something to put outside. And I end up taking this one from high school years and sizing it up. Um, but yeah, I ended up doing the train paint off camera. So I did do that. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this speed build. Um, please come back to see the furnishings and I will see y'all next week. Bye.